So, it's June, and that's Pride Month. And because of that, I would like to make a video on that topic. So, first, let me explain. My wonderful mother is a hairstylist, and so I was raised in a hair salon. I am so grateful for this. Um, because I lived in a small town and otherwise I don't think I would have been exposed to LGBT culture as much as I was growing up in the hair salon with my mom because my mom is just um, a wonderful caring person and she loves everyone and you know she always had lesbian uh, gay friends um, you know uh, transgender friends and those people were around me growing up as I was a kid and kind of raised me in a lot of ways in the hair salon with my mom. I was taught how to put on my makeup by a gay man when I was a kid, uh, or not, not a kid, but a teenager. Um, so those people were a part of my life and it was just no big deal to me growing up. And I'm so grateful that I had that kind of experience um, because those people are still part of my life and I honestly, you know, my own personal feelings about, you know, relationships and sexuality and gender are that you love who you love and it shouldn't matter to other people who you love. That really shouldn't be their business, you know? You shouldn't hold someone's love against them. Love is a wonderful thing. We should encourage more love, if anything. We shouldn't be discouraging people from loving one another. That's so crazy. Love is like the thing this world needs more than anything right now is more love. Um, so I, I just can't understand the, the bigots and the haters who can't get behind supporting love in general. It just seems crazy to me. Um, and I'm not going to talk about my personal sexuality in this video, but maybe someday I will. But I just wanted to say, love who you love. And it doesn't matter if that's same gender, different gender, no gender, you know, whatever, no one, asexual. You know, just do you and don't listen to the haters. All right, guys, you have a good one.